Lomax, little dink over the top. Oh, it's come up for Gasco. It's come up for Gasco. It's come up for St. Helens. Nelly, Nelly for St. Helens. With Roby. Oh, Roby gets it away. Gasco short ball. And there is a try for Andrew Dixon. Andy, perfect sir. Way to christen this stadium. Yeah, yeah, it's, uh, it's great to get off to the new stadium with a win. Um, we just really need to get this result out of the way. Uh, we know we needed a win here. Royce has drilled it into us. Um, you know, it's important that we make this ground a bit of a fortress for ourselves. And, uh, yeah, it's good that we got a good performance in the second half. Uh, a try on your home debut. How, how, how was it out there? Yeah, it was good. You know, the start wasn't real. You know, what we're happy with. You know, the, the first 40 minutes we just totally didn't play how we wanted to play. And yeah, I think half time coming at a good time for us. I see my give us a good chat, and I think we come out better in the second 40. What, what did you put that sluggish start down to? Is it perhaps the occasion a little bit? Yeah, maybe, you know, maybe we've got a bit overall the occasion, you know, it's, it's a very special occasion, you know, for our players and, you know, for the club. So, you yeah, know, now that's behind us, I suppose the, um, the initiation's out of the way and you can get on the season. Yeah, I think we let all, all the pre-match uh, nerves get to us a little bit in the first 20 minutes, but then after that uh, we, we settled in and we started playing the rugby that we have been doing the previous weeks. And you're new to Super League, has it been everything you expected so far? Yeah, and more, you know, I'm really enjoying myself, you know, the footy's great and, um, you know, come to a quality club and be up against some great opposition as well. 20 minutes there, it, it looked like you were going to spoil the Saints' party. Yeah, we, we, we played well in the first half, um, we didn't have much good ball, but what, you know, what we had, we've, we, we made to our advantage and we, we looked clinical and we, you know, put some good players on and that, and we kind of shook St. Helens up a little bit. Uh, like I said, we didn't get much good ball, to be fair, but you know, our completion was pretty high and, and uh, did all the right things. Um, I was up towards 80 percent in the first half and we always in with a chance. I think uh, we probably let the occasion get to us a little bit, thinking, you know, uh, and I think we, we were showing plenty of effort, but we weren't playing as a team. And if you're not playing as a team, the first thing that will suffer is your ball completion, and that's exactly what happened. Saints obviously up the tempo in the second half, they must have got... You know, good telling off, and then uh, they come out firing. Uh, and obviously, you know, we didn't we didn't go with it, and we made a few errors ourselves, compounded with the you know penalties, and a couple of decisions didn't go our way. And then next minute, you know, the Saints have just hit you with two tries, and uh, you know, obviously we're not we're not helping ourselves in the second half by turning over so much ball. Uh, you can't do that against the top teams like St. Helens. But uh, you know, if we could bottle the first 40 up, you know, we'd be in with a chance of winning. And uh, you, you're pleased that you uh, christened this place with the, with the right result? Yeah, well, you know, as you said at half time there, I was thinking about jumping the back fence and heading home somewhere because it uh, would have been uh, not the ideal uh, start to this great stadium, would it be?